You know what time it is, this is Monday Movie Pickup. Big Trouble in Little China. This is actually a pretty cool slipcover they made. As you can see on the other side, it's just a normal Blu-ray edition. I thought there was like a special edition of this movie made by Shout Factory or something like that, but I guess that hasn't been done yet. I guess Arrow Video did one for the UK, but for now this is the only edition of Big Trouble in Little China that's on Blu-ray, but it's uh, still got a good number of special features. It's a really good movie as well. really like this artwork for this cover, so I'm glad I got this version. Apocalypse Now. I have been waiting to get this version of the movie for the longest time. This is the triple feature version. So this comes with Apocalypse Now, the longer version of it, which I don't think I've ever seen, and Heart of Darkness, which is, of course, a documentary about the making of the movie. And um, so it comes with two discs. And I've been seeing the edition for a while that just comes with this disc, with the movie and the, the director's cut, I suppose. And then... Uh, but not this version, not with this disc. I finally found it the other day for pretty cheap, so that made me really happy. Then we have here, How to Win, How to Marry a Millionaire. I have no idea what this movie is, but I saw it for so cheap at the Best Buy bin, I figured I'm gonna give it a try. It even comes with some special features, that's awesome. It's a Marilyn Monroe comedy movie. I'm just gonna watch it and we'll see what happens. I like old comedies like that. Requiem for a Dream, consider one of the better uh, movies, I believe, of the early 2000s. I think this movie actually came out in 2000, and uh, yeah, considered one of the best movies of that year. I'm excited to give this a watch. Been putting it off for way too many years. Ghost and Mr. Chicken. I saw this in the Best Buy deals bin, and this is a movie I heard about during. Cinemassacre's video on Psycho, and it's actually uh, about that house, how that house had a resemblance to the Psycho house, and however Universal, whatever they did with the original Psycho house, if they repurposed it for this movie or not, I saw it for cheap and I was like, I'm gonna find out what this movie's all about, because that's a really dumb title for a movie. Porky's, the original uh, sex comedy. I, uh, this is one, I, I actually have not seen this, so... Yeah, I'm sorry, but finally bought it, I'm gonna watch it. If you see the Sylvester Stallone triple pack for five bucks, you buy it. It comes with Assassins, directed by Richard Donner, uh, Cobra, and then The Specialist. So, yeah. Don't know much about all these, but I'm a big Richard Donner fan. And uh, I'm excited to give all the other ones a watch. I like Stallone a lot. Tinker Taylor Soldier Spy, I've been putting off this movie for way too long. Gary Oldman, one of my favorite actors ever, and uh, this is one that he got nominated for Best Actor for. Didn't win, finally won last year for The Darkest Hour, but yeah, I will, I'm happy to finally give that a watch. And Hotel Transylvania 2, I have the first one, I was going to rewatch them both. I actually already saw the third one. Um, third one was okay, I mean, it, it was, I don't know, it was, uh, I, maybe these ones are a lot better, but... I know I'm probably going to have to review all these eventually, so I'll be getting to that soon. Yeah, and those were the movies for this week. See you next time. Thanks for watching the video. A special thanks to Chris and Ryan for supporting me on Patreon. If you'd like to join them in getting exclusive videos and blogs, early access, and even be able to request reviews monthly, then please click on the Patreon link and thanks for the support.